Welcome back, welcome back to another episode of GTA LSP5 Patrol on the channel. As you guys know, I've been working on a mod recently, and the next update is due on the 15th of this month. So here's some a sneak peek, and this episode is kind of going to be a sneak peek into some of the updates, features that I'll be adding. I'll be adding three new departments and vehicles to fit those departments the three departments i'll be adding would be Los, An Los santos airport police which will be stationed within the lsia area i'll also be adding in the Spoochie beach Spoochie area police so which would already be stationed in the Spoochie area if we would see on the map that I updated with the 1.3.2 update. At the moment, as you can see, I'm within the Potantos Airport Police Department, just driving around patrolling the jurisdiction at the moment, make sure, making sure nothing special is going on. So with the Los Santos Airport Police Department now, it would make it more um, suitable to do then so when I was on the um LSPFR page that there's a new call out called um airport callouts. Now you can actually role play with the Los Santos Airport Police Department that I'm adding in. You can use that call out and do um patrols within the LSIA area. Which is a decently large area. I also added the, the stations for LSIA and Del Perro Police before Del Perro did not have a station in my last update, but this time it does. Just had to get the position. I may also add in, I'm not sure where I'm going to put this one, but I may also add in a, a station for Grape Seed PD. I'm not sure the actual location yet on the map where I'm going to put it. Anyway, let's get into today's patrol. Dispatch to Adam 5. Show me 1041. At the moment, I don't have the airport um, callouts installed. I'm just patrolling within this area. You would now and then see some vehicles from other jurisdictions like that vehicle that just went there. They passed. That's a vehicle from um, LSPD, which right now is the vehicle that's patrolling um, Spoochie Beach because I haven't added that in yet. So eventually that would change and you would see the Spoochie vehicles coming across into LSIA and heading back. They sometimes they cross like within like a few meters they cross two sections. But then most likely stay in their jurisdiction. Check the airport car park here. Yeah, I was going the wrong way there. Yeah. Yeah, I may just move the station now realizing that this is the actual station there. I may move the station but you guys will get the update once I figure out everything. 
with the station location right now. Let's have a look at the position and everything. Bunch of team to the area. Dude, watch out what you're doing there. The hell. Alright, so let's patrol in. For this patrol we'd be doing a little more traffic stuff and in the future when I'm patrolling within um, LSIA area, the airport police, I'd probably add in the airport police mod call out back so that I get call outs within the area. Next mod that I'm thinking of making guys is the it's kind of a mod that makes you know what you guys think of this a mod that makes makes um the callouts only come within the area that you're in the jurisdiction that you're within so like if you're within lsia you only only get callouts within that area of Jurisdiction next by registration. Taxi up there just got flagged for expired registration. There you go. Oops. Whoa. That vehicle right there. Dispatch from in a traffic stop. Show me on a traffic stop. You can see the Tahoe, well that's the, that's not a Tahoe, that's a SUV version to what I have right now, that's an airport police, ambient police spawned in. Yeah, 
His registration is expired. He has no um in the car. May I see your ID, please? Thanks. Twenty twenty registration. Dispatch request and pet check. License valid. Valid. All right. There's a probably a company. Well, it's definitely a company vehicle. I'm just gonna. Notify him that the insurance is expired. Right. The insurance registration of the vehicle is expired. I'll leave him at a warning since it's a taxi and yeah, I'll just give him a warning. Because I didn't smell anything suspicious or anything. This part show me 1041. As you see guys, the patrol that I'm doing today is a bit late in the afternoon. It's actually a night patrol. You probably already know because I've probably said it a couple of times on the channel. But it's actually night time right now. I have a real time mod installed. So yeah, I'm actually recording this expired license. Black. The board. That vehicle up there just gets flagged for an expired license. He's not supposed to be driving, so if he doesn't have any drugs or anything on him, I'm just gonna um, There's no drugs in the vehicle or anything. I'm probably just gonna give him a seize the vehicle and call a taxi for him. They're not supposed to drive him. Red license. This part show me on a traffic stop. Request and plate check. Target vehicle license plate. Six seven Victor Edward Zebra two Niners six 
A traffic violation. Approach with caution. May I see your ID, please? Thanks. And since that has been expired since the 10th of the 7th month, 2020. It's last year. Or the 7th of the 10th. I don't know how it goes. Uh, just for this guy, I'm just gonna ask him to step out of the vehicle quick. Just do a pat down. Kind of suspicious about him. Because your license has been so expired so long. Yet you. Want me to give you a warning? Nope. So we'll move to the side of the road, yeah. There was another airport for this vehicle. Ah, uh, bag of blue crystals, which can possibly be some type of drug. Because that um, is a suspicious item to have on him, he's gonna get detained for now. Not fully arrested, but detained for now. You're going away for a long time. Until we test and see what that drug actually is. Let's just leave him there for now. He's right there, I can see him. Drop the pad here. Negative uh, cocaine, testing for methamphetamine right now. Negative. Last option, PCP. Okay, pos positive for PCP. He's gonna get arrested for possession of Angel Dosh slash PCP, which is a scheduled two narcotics, and it is a felony arrest. Let's search as we go quick here. He has nothing interesting in his vehicle at the moment, so you just tow the vehicle right now. This patch request in tow truck. I'm gonna test him since we found PCP on him. I'm gonna do a drug swap test to make sure he's not driving under the influence of any sort of narcotics. Thanks. Okay, he's not under the influence of any narcotics.
first arrest for the day. Yes, it has been nice, very fair. fair. You got a messy minute for driving on expired license. And possession of Schedule 2 narcotics, which was PCP. That's he, he had one felony in charge and a uh, misdemeanor. Originally, I stopped him for the expired license, which still know to be very, very long. Uh, his license has been expired for 183 days. So knowing that his license has been excited for that long and he has been stopped before, as you can see he has a history of failure to signal. So he has a history a history of getting stopped four times. But his license expired. He probably got stopped for his license before and just got a warning. This time he didn't get away. He got charged for the expired license and we also found PCP on him, so he got charged, a felony charge for the drugs at he had on him. Let's go drop him off quick here. Here we go. Okay, you turn here. Oopsie, I'm out. Let me go down here. You're wondering why the game is slightly a bit more laggy than usual. It's night time and there's a lot of lights on, so it's causing a bit of lag compared to during the day. Take the back road here. I said I wasn't going to open the gate for me. At the moment, the station that I added in is at inside the airport which usually would be on the outside that's how to get the coordinates for the one on the outside and place it there probably do that within the next few days is it on the gate? Really? Lord. Alright guys, I just got this part out quick. Let's see you guys. Later on. Might up and wrap up the episode as this one is just a short episode.
I'll probably just call a transport to come and pick him up while I go patrol the rest of the area. This patch request and transport. Ten four transport required. This also is kind of a showcase which show you the ultimate backup has also been configured to release the specific vehicle slots for specific jurisdictions. So as you saw I just called tra transport. But in the jurisdiction of um, airport police jurisdiction, as you can see, they pulled up in the airport police uniform and in an airport police vehicle SUV to be particular with. So that's one of the benefits of having this departmental vehicle slots. Again, the link for the download page would be down in the description. Be sure to follow the download because I try to update as often as possible. And if you run into any bugs with the plugin, just let me know either down in the comments on the download page or you can join my, disc my Discord server, which would be linked in the bottom of the video in the description. You can join my Discord server and let me know there also. Hope you guys, hope you guys enjoyed this short episode and a bit of a showcase of the new department that I've planned to add in on the next update of departmental vehicle slots. I'll see you guys in the next one. Enjoy the rest of your night. I'm out. Peace.